What's going on YouTube? Grimlon here today, bringing you guys a brand new video. And today, me and my buddies are vlogging at Gen Con 50. Uh, we just parked in like the sketchiest parking structure I think I've ever been in. It's like an honor system, which I've never seen before. You just put $10 in an envelope and put it in the box and then they just, I guess, hope that you actually pay the money or someone comes by and checks often. I don't know. We'll be all right because we actually are honorable people. We're lawful good, right? Yeah, yeah we're lawful good. It's pretty good. All right, so we're super sketched out right now because we're at this like honor parking place and you just drop the, the, the money in here and then you drop it in the lockbox. So I we think. seal the envelope. It says year, make, color. So I have to like write out all that so they know like where to find my car instead of looking for the number. <laughs> I, the Indianapolis works on an honor system. We're from Detroit. It's nothing like that at all. <laughs> Um, all right, so I guess we'll just do this. All set up. <laughs> just got our badges. Um, probably gonna head to the dealer's hall right now, the exhibit hall. I always F that one up. Um, go check out the booths, and then either play test games or play in the League of Legends tournament. Let well, know. Is it everything you'd hope it would be? And more. And more? <laughs> this is insane. I come here every year and it still just blows my mind. Alright, I don't even know where to start. Um, let's just start right here. Let's start this and go spot. down. Like this area around here is mainly like big companies. Like Fantasy Flight does a lot of like board games and stuff. Um, Alrighty, mission success. This is our first success of the convention so far. <laughs> Thus far it's been a lot of wandering. We finally found a program book so we can sign up for some D&D games. Um, right now it's looking like Pathfinder, but we're trying to find some 5th edition to play. Um, we signed up for the league tournament. My boy Lawrence, and I think his name was Jacob, who gave me the book. Yeah. Go hit up Jacob at Adventure Registration, tell him some love. Um, he definitely helped us out here, because if not, we're going to be wandering around trying to find games all night, so he's definitely helped out. Alright, we got some pizza for breakfast. It's like 10 o'clock right now, we're going to have some donuts too. You know, actually, I'm thinking about a cupcake as well, boys. Split a cupcake? Yeah, Last year, Last year they had like Darth Vader cupcakes, it was really cool. Like five dollars, but it was totally worth it, they were delicious. It's the breakfast of champions right here, this is how you survive convention life. For real. Eat it or something. How's the Nutella donut? Did you see that? Oh my god. Is it that good? I'm so excited to get into mine. I'm not even, I took a huge bite and I'm not even near like the Nutella. David's got coffee in a can. How is it? It's good. Is it really? I'll take a sip. Yo, that tastes like like the Starbucks like in the uh, glass. Yeah, Actually, yeah, really yeah. good. Joe. Yeah. This is Gen Con. Guys, and everybody picks something for you to smell, and you have to guess who it is. Anything to smell. Oh, somebody. To smell. Oh, somebody to smell. I was like, what are you smelling here? Yeah. And is it any part? Any part of the person people to smell? Really creative. Like okay. uh, last year, people were like taking, they picked somebody up and like put his feet right in the guy's face, and he had no idea, but he just couldn't even bear it. So, <laughs> so it's a lot of fun. It's super highly interactive. Think, oh, that's so cool. You get the dice, you get the game. You have a good group of friends here at the con. It's a great con game to play. Oh, for sure. It's only twenty-five bucks for both. What's up, man? So, let us know if we can hit you up a copy. Yes, and we'll come back. We can try it. Yeah, let's 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 wait on the expansions. Yeah, yeah. David's first purchase is the Game of Thrones card game. It's not bad. It's a pretty good purchase. I like it. On sale. We got to go to RPG conventions though, so you can have a first RPG purchase, or just at the auction. Yeah. yeah. No, that's definitely a good price. Instead of fifty dollars, fifteen dollars. Jon Snow is playing Game of Thrones Catan. That's way too bad. That's so bad. <laughs> Alright, so my dumbass just left the camera in the car after we went and dropped some stuff off. So we're going up to the JW Marriott right now and we're going to try to play some Adventures League. Um, I assume they'll have walk-up games. I, there's no way they would just like sell out of Adventures League. 
So I know Pathfinder Society is like nowhere near sold out still. It's like Friday at noon. So we're gonna try to find the room right now. Oh, Griffin Hall. Nice. Yep. Yeah, this is it. No weapons. Is my so a bard isn't allowed to bring his mouth. His voice. His voice. His, his, his loot. <laughs> no loot's allowed here. Alright, so we finally found out everything for Adventures League. Um, we're making our characters right now, starting at level 1. Um, we're just rolling everything, because it makes it more fun. And uh, I've rolled half orc for race, which is interesting. Because it really only fits into, like, barbarian and fighter, I feel like. Maybe ranger, but um, we'll see what I get. There's three. Cleric. <laughs> the half orc cleric. Not bad, yeah. David, what did you get? I am the Halfling Warlock. Halfling Warlock and... I got a Half-Elf uh, Noble Druid. Half-Elf Noble Druid. Okay, so I'm going Cleric. <sighs> That's gonna be fun to play. I don't know, like, you. I guess I have to denounce my whole Orc side completely. If I'm gonna be able to be a Cleric. I, I think I'm gonna... I'm already thinking, like, I wanna do, like, a War Cleric or something I that would make a little bit more sense. I know. I identify as, I'm an orc, but I identify as a gnome. I'll probably have to cut that out. <laughs> yeah, you are playing a lot of casters. <laughs> We're not switching it now. We're not spending another hour and a half. No, no, no. I meant, I'll play it for this. I meant, if Rogar ever dies, I'm thinking of backup character, but probably not. Oh, is a warlock is your backup? Right, but probably not. I don't want to go from Another so charisma-based <laughs> caster. Yeah. Same, same thing, almost. Like, yeah, I I usually play casters in my games. Um, whoa, gotta go. These things are crazy. Oh, it's gonna stop real quick again, and then we gotta run. <laughs> this one's all glitchy and stuff. Um, wow, it's probably loud on the street. Yeah, I usually play casters. So playing like a cleric, which is like in 5e, you can play them like both ways. So I think that'll be fun that I can play it like you know a melee caster kind of with this temp tempest idea. We're gonna hit a food truck right now. We don't know which one yet. Well, we might do Chipotle. So we gotta go this way. Or this way. We gotta go this way. We gotta go this way. We're gonna go this way. Now, right, y'all, we got a food vlog going. Double steak burrito. Zach got a chicken burrito. David got his chorizo burrito, but he's currently dumping some diesel, so. We'll see David in like 10 minutes. How is it? It's nice. It's a wait, right? What are you thinking now? After you hold it. I do want it. You want it? Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Thank you. This is the master behind it. Actually made it. It's so awesome. No, go ahead. That little short guy. 40, 42, 40, 44. He says 50. Oh, that did it. The magic number. $50. Any further interest? 3176 for 50 bucks. And I thank you for coming tonight. I thank you for being part of my last story auction. I'm going to sign this film in the bank now. And um, I hope you guys keep coming. Thank you. Three thousand once. 
3,000 twice. Congratulations, sir. Six wow. He's going to check out right now. <laughs> he's, he's buying that right now. <laughs> so that guy just gave Frank the meteorite dice. I'm, oh my god. Alright, you can do it. Lift. David, are you serious? David, lift it. Yeah! <laughs> it's so painful to put the backpack on after you take it off. It's very tough. Our backs are killing us. Zach has this jacket. Z z z da 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 da. Has a giant sword. We're gonna unbox, unbox that before we go, like in the parking lot, for sure, yeah, for sure. Yeah, we can't drive for five hours and not just let that sit there without being opened. You gotta Imagine twirl around and everything. And explaining this to the cop. Oh my god, <laughs> I never even thought about that. So don't well, get pulled over, how about? Don't, don't get pulled over, yeah. Don't get pulled over. Wait, they were talking to me. <laughs> yeah, you're driving. <laughs> All right. Walking out of the convention center for the last time. It's a sad moment leaving a convention. But we are gonna go hit Steak and Shake. We haven't done it yet. It's right next to the convention center. Feels sad leaving. Feels really sad. Let's get one last shot. Of all the food trucks, the convention center. And Gen Con 50 is coming to its conclusion. Best way to end Gen Con is always steak and shake. We've got barbecue bacon burger, regular burger with bacon and cheese, and then I don't even know what's on yours. Mushroom and onion and squid. Just a whole lot of great stuff. We got milkshakes coming too. Yeah. Steak and shake is definitely the move. It's like five dollars for a burger. We didn't know any of this. We're spending like twenty dollars at Vito's. Twice. <laughs> Twice. Could have just came here. Oh well. What do you call it? Like, what's the name of this it's thing? It's called a Polaris Slingshot. Polaris Slingshot? Right. Uh -huh. Oh my, all right, let's see it sling, man. Is it custom? Uh, not a custom work done to it, but yeah, five. That's so awesome. Just send me one when you get a chance. There you go. There you go. That's so awesome, dude. Oh my. I gotta take this off first. God, all right, son. Dang, dude. King Lane, all hail. That's amazing. How's it feel? Give it a swing. Give her a swing. Slice the car. <laughs> Dude, that is so badass. This is definitely Can you one hand it? Uh, Uncomfortably? There's no way you could fight with this one hand. It's too big. This is definitely a two handed sword. You know? Dude, that is awesome. Let's see, David. Give it a whirl. Swing it around. Swing it around. Swing it around. Baseball bat. <laughs> That's so badass. I even play World of Warcraft. I'm right. awesome. Yeah, yeah. That is a uh, King Lane sword from World of Warcraft, the Warcraft movie. If you've seen it. Um, anyways, guys, that is gonna end our Gen Con adventures. Um, I'm gonna get out of the sun. It's painful. That's going to end our Gen Con adventures. Um, thank you so much for watching. Um, Twitter and Twitch is in the description down below, uh, as well as my personal Facebook. Uh, it's mainly where I'm going to keep everything up to date for the YouTube channel. Um, hopefully I'll be back next year doing the same kind of vlogs. The next convention vlogs I'm going to do is Game Hole Con in November, or in November at Madison, Wisconsin. Um, so thank you again so much for watching. Keep your roles and your spirits high, and I'll see you next time.